Hey guys, this is Smriti. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is a good old makeup haul. I purchased a lot on Black Friday and some of them did take a lot of time to come to me. We are going to go through the entire haul and the next video you'll see me use everything. So if you're ready to just see what all I purchased for this sale season, then please keep on watching. Okay, let's start off with the first thing that I actually purchased as soon as the Black Friday deal was like launched and that was a set from makeup forever and this was a set of lip liners and eyeliners it came as a set of five and i feel like all of them are really really good especially because they are like tones of everyday browns i really love it i've used this on my channel already i'll link that video in the eye cards above for you guys i have wherever walnut we have all around white whatever black then we have limitless brown and anywhere caffeine these are all like best sellers from Makeup Forever and I wanted to test out Makeup Forever for such a long time and I felt like this set was just up for me. So this was the first thing that I purchased from uh, the Sephora haul. And then along with that, I also got this Rare Beauty highlighter in the shade Flaunt. I already have a shade Mesmerize with me and I definitely wanted like a deeper toned shade, uh, especially for like when I'm tan. So I purchased Flaunt and I am loving it. I'm actually wearing Flaunt on my face today. I powdered it on top of that, so you might not be able to see it, but that's basically what I have on my face. So apart from that, I also got like a card from Rare Beauty when I purchased those uh, with two highlighter samples and two blush samples. So that's how this looks, I think. That was, no actually, and then I purchased this Huda Beauty Pretty Grunge Palette, which you've already seen on my channel. I've done several looks using this palette. Absolutely loving, loving this palette. So that was a purchase that I did from Sephora. Not that I got any sale on this palette. I was actually waiting on Huda Beauty's website because I know that Huda does a lot of sales, but this time she didn't do any sales on the newer palette so that was a bummer but i did have like a ten dollar off coupon uh, in sephora so i thought that let's just buy it because i definitely wanted to get this in my collection talking about huda beauty i did purchase a few things from her site like older things so the main thing that i really wanted to get was her naughty nude palette so i did purchase her naughty nude palette I definitely have to use this in my channel, but offline I have used like two shades, nothing much. I did use like two, actually three shades. I used Rough, Naughty and Plays Me, but if you've not seen, I'd highly doubt. This is how Naughty Nude palette looks. I feel like this is gonna be like the most used Huda Beauty palette that I have in my collection. I enjoy using Huda Beauty palettes, but this is like right up my alley. I love burgundies and browns and that's exactly what this is. I don't know why I waited this long to purchase this. Actually, I know because it's expensive, but I did get a good amount of discount on this palette. I think it was like 30% off. So I got that. And along with that, I also purchased a few lipsticks from Huda Beauty. I got this balmy, glowy lipstick in the shade Gold Digger. Again, both of them are like brown that I got. But let me swatch it for you. That is the shade Gold Digger. It's definitely like a glossy finish. And then I got a matte finish lipstick in the shade last night. It looks very, very similar to each other. I am more into a brown tone person. This is more like a gray brown. Again, this one is in the shade last night. And when I purchased these items, they did send out a multi-dew skin tint in the shade tan light. I'll definitely use that in the next video. And they also sent out legit lashes mascara sample. So we'll use that also in the video this i don't know if i'm going to use it in the video or not they also send out the wishful yo glow enzyme scrub i'll definitely use it and let you know if it works properly or not so those were huda beauty things from indie brand i did get a pr package from mba cosmetics and i got their pumpkin kisses and autumn wishes palette this is actually the look that i created using this palette this is how the palette looks really really pretty palette i linked the video that i tested this out in the icons above for you guys to check it out really really impressed by the mba cosmetics and then uh this was not a sale item but i did purchase this and this is from whatsapp beauty and this is the dragon eye palette again i've reviewed this palette also on my channel beautiful beautiful palette i'm a big eyeshadow person and i've definitely crossed my limit for this year for purchasing eyeshadow palettes 
but no regrets these palettes are all really really pretty and then i got this unearthly cosmetics fall magic palette also when they were having a sale on their website again a beautiful color sorry this is one palette that i was eyeing from unearthly for such a long time and i'm glad that i plunged and i got this palette really really pretty very 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 beautiful palette and amazing quality then i bought a few things uh from melt's website because melt was having a tremendous like amazing sale most of the items were like 50 to 80 percent off most of them 80 percent actually so i got a box from melt cosmetics too so let's start off with the highlighter because this is one thing that i definitely wanted to try from them i've never tried any face products from them only eyeshadow palettes so i definitely had my eyes on this highlighter this one is in the shade gold or stunning it looks cannot wait to test this out tomorrow really really pretty look how stunning it looks it actually does remind me of dior uh highlighters i think it's because of that embossing but i really really am excited to play with this and then i also purchased a blush from them and this one is in the shade Honey Thief. I went with a powder version instead of a cream version just because I feel like I've always seen myself dip into more of powder formula, especially when I'm in a hurry. And this is the shade Honey Thief. Again, super excited to test this out. This definitely is a little bit on the lighter uh, side. I was thinking it is definitely more on a mid-tone side. It seems a little lighter, but we don't know. When we'll put it on our face, then we'll know much better. So that was the blush. I also got an eyeliner, a burgundy eyeliner, which I was eyeing. This one actually is listed as rich brown, but seemed like burgundy. So very excited about that too. Burgundy is my shade. I really, really love to have like colorful eyeliners but like more in a deeper color i really love it i also got a lipstick from them and this one is in the shade on the go i've not opened this is yet so let's see the lipstick tube looks a little smaller as compared to a regular size tube see oh this looks so beautiful look at the embossing this looks right up my alley really really pretty super excited to try this and then because they were having such a huge discount too i thought of uh, getting two palettes for you guys for a giveaway actually a giveaway is running on my channel should i even open this let me get my palettes out for you guys so that i can show you these are all packaged so this is basically gemini one and gemini two packaged together uh, and this was for a giveaway for you guys i'll put all the details of the giveaway in the description box below for you guys if you guys want to enter but let me show you the palettes i absolutely enjoy my palette so i felt like if anybody gets these palettes who doesn't have it they'll absolutely enjoy it this is gemini one beautiful color story with everyday and grungy tones little bit more on like a, a warmer green tone color story and then this is gemini 2 you know how much i love my rosy tones and this is right up my alley i really really love it i actually use both of these shadows so very much in my everyday life that i really was excited about this and last certainly not the least in for the haul i did purchase the morphe and the ariel brush collection this is how the brush collection looks so i'll definitely give this a try tomorrow in the video i'll let you guys know i've not opened this brush box let's see open it and see how it looks it looks seriously very promising and i've seen like ali lines rave about this uh brush collection from morphe oof give me a minute this packaging is so luxe so luxe Ooh. look at this it looks so pretty man so pretty oh i'm excited for this so excited for this and this was like on 50 percent off on alta and then they had another coupon to stack on top to get ten dollars off i think i got this whole collection for like twenty dollars or thirty dollars or something like that i felt like that was an amazing deal 
so that was all that i have for the haul and i'll test it for you guys in the next video if you did like this video you know what to do do give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and ring that notification bell so that you're notified every time that i post next i generally upload three videos every single week every tuesdays thursdays and saturdays at 9 a.m eastern standard time until next time i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys